Hi, and welcome back to Market Conversations. Today is February 17th. The market is red today, which creates a good buying opportunity if there are a few companies that you've been wanting to get into. In this video, I'm going to show you how I'm going to close out a option contract. So if you guys are interested in watching, go ahead and stick around. But before I continue, I just want to let you know that I am not a financial advisor. This is just for entertainment purposes only. Also, I created a Patreon page where like-minded people can talk about stocks, options, cryptocurrencies, and anything and everything in between. It is only 33 cents per day, and I will also be sharing my trades on there. So if you guys are interested, I will go ahead and post my link down below. So I been selling cash to care puts for a while now and a couple weeks ago i sold one on nano dimension so we'll take a look at nano dimension so nano dimension is gonna this contract is going to expire this friday so whenever i sell a cash second i have to put up the collateral so the collateral is calculated by 100 times the strike price so the strike price is 1250 as we can see above here so that would be $1,250 that's tied up. I was able to collect $131, but there's only $7 left. And I want to be able to use the money for something else. So what I can do now, instead of letting it expire worthless on Friday, because the strike price is $12.50 and the stock price right now is at $14.32. I do not think that Nano Dimension is going to go to $12.50 or below. And I just want to be able to use the money, the collateral that I am using for this, for something else. So what I can do is buy back the option contract. When I initially traded this, it was sell to open. Now I want to buy to close. But when you are buying an option, it's usually buy to open and sell to close. So this is the complete opposite. Sell to open, buy to close. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna buy to close this option contract. We see here, buy nano dimension, 1250 puts, 219. And we have one contract, it's under that name. So how many contracts do we wanna buy back? Well, we wanna buy back one contract. And how much do we wanna pay for that? $7. Okay, review. See, released collateral. See, we can see that the, re the collateral is going to be released back to us, $1,250. And let's take a look at the order summary. You're paying $7 to buy back one open contract, which will release collateral and remove your obligation to buy 100 shares of Nano Dimension for $12.50 on or before February 19. So I'm going to swipe up to submit and it did get filled. So let's calculate how much I was able to receive on this cash secure put. So I collected $131 and I had to pay back $7. So in total, I was able to collect $124. And when I first sold this cash secure put, it was on January 27th. In three weeks, I was able to make $124 which isn't bad at all. And it's actually less risk versus buying a option call because Nano Dimension, if we take a look at Nano Dimension, it dropped. Why did it drop? Because they announced a stock offering yesterday and they've been announcing stock offerings for the past few months now. And Nano Dimension will go up like it's always been doing stock offering price goes down and then eventually it recovers but we just don't know when it's going to recover and what are they going to do with this money rumor is there's going to be an acquisition but we don't know when or if there is going to be one but with all the money that they are raising it has to be an acquisition so now that i have money in my accounts let's go back to the home page buying power is 3293 it was around one thousand earlier or less than that so i'm gonna buy lucon technologies i already bought some shares earlier so i'm not able to buy 
Luca technology on Weibo or Thinkorswim TD Ameritrade. I'm able to do it on Robinhood, and so that's why I'm using Robinhood. What are the odds of that happening? I'm just gonna buy 200 more shares. Buy 200 shares. I'm just gonna go ahead and do market order because the bid and ask price is not much of a difference. And I just wanna get filled right away. And then we're gonna swipe up. Completed, done, and it's filled. So my average cost is 207, I have a thousand shares. And they just announced a stock offering today as well. Let's so Lucon Technology announces $100 million registered direct offering priced at the market under NASDAQ rules. They are offering of $100 million at a price of $2.08 per share. The company will issue a total of 48 million shares to the institutional investors. And the offering is expected to close on or about February 19th, which is in two days. So this is their second offering. It's good for long-term investors and it's bad for short-term investors because the shares are diluted. But if we're in this for the long haul, this dip should not matter and we should continue to add. And so that's why I wanted to get in because yesterday it, was, it went to a high of $3. So I just want to take advantage of this dip since I didn't buy it last week when it was around $1. And that's all I have for you guys for today. Hope you learn something new about closing a option contract. And please do consider joining the Patreon page. I am here to help and grow as a community as well as being able to grow our accounts together. Thanks a lot. Hi there. If you are interested in helping out the channel, you can sign up for Weibo if you haven't already. They are currently offering two free stocks now. It used to be four, so you don't want to wait until it gets to one free stock or no stocks at all. So you get one free stock when you open up a Weibo account. And when you deposit $100 or more, you get one more free stock, which is valued between $8 and $1,600. And if you are transferring from another brokerage, they will reimburse you the fees up to $100. And you will also receive a complimentary three-month subscription to Level 2 Events NASDAQ Total View from the day you sign up. So guys, what are you waiting for? Two free stocks are waiting for you. Thanks again.